What's up guys, it's King Josh back with another video and today I have a jump shot video for you guys So before the video starts make sure to drop a like and anyway, let's get right into the video So this video is gonna be about two minutes long I'm gonna keep it short for you guys in this first minute you guys can see this is my rebounding wing build and I do have a 73 pointer and this jump shot actually helps me a ton It kind of looks weird as you guys can see it is a weird looking jump shot but the good thing about it is it's super easy to time. I can tell when to release the ball. And the way I actually found this jump shot, I actually went to my team. And since I can shoot really well with that bull bull card, I went to my league to find his jump shot base. As you can see, easy ankle break right there. I kind of waited for him to get back, pulled the three, and that's green. But yeah, on this player, I do have a 73 pointer at 99 overall. So some jump shots I can shoot well, some I don't. Some days I'm inconsistent with this jump shot because I actually did lose all of my hot zones. So I kind of changed my badges around. I don't have hot zone hunter anymore. I'm going to wait till I get my hot zones back. So basically I don't even have hot zone hunter and I'm still hitting my threes at a high rate. So right here you can see all of these clips from here on out will be on my slasher build. And this player has a 49 three pointer. And sometimes with this jump shot, I feel like I shoot better on this player than on my rebounding wing. So like I said, this player has a 49-3, my rebounding wing has a 73, and with this jump shot, I can shoot really well on both players. So, I actually don't have the custom jump shot because I lost the custom jump shot on all my players. My PS4 actually got corrupted, and I also lost all my hot zones. But anyway, the jump shot is actually just Michael Beasley. And I know that kind of sounds weird, and the jump shot also does look weird, but the way he flicks the ball back and then flicks it back forward, that lets me know when to release it, and I feel like a good release point where you can tell where to release the shot is good to have on any jump shot. So that's going to be it for the video. Make sure to drop a like. If you guys end up trying out the jump shot, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I know it looks weird, but trust me, this is actually a really good jump shot. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's been King Josh, and I'm out. Peace.